Hey guys, this is Julie Roth with Hague Realtors and JR Designs. I am here in the beautiful Montgomery showroom and I'm going to talk with my friend Michelle, who's also an interior designer, about some of the trends that we're seeing in interior design. So come on in, Michelle. Hi there. Hey. So um, tell me a little bit about your background, like how long have you been in interior design? You know, how'd you get into it? I have been doing design for close to 20 years. I graduated from UNI in Iowa uh, with my bachelor's degree in interior design. And I came to Montgomery's about nine years ago and I've been doing um, in-home appointments and lots of design ever since. Um, what are you seeing out there that you're absolutely loving, like newer trends? Uh, some of the newer trends, I think the, the wood is kind of changing as far as the really cool tones to a little bit warmer tones. Uh, going a little bit away from all the heavy gray, gray, white. It's a little cold and the warmth of the warm woods more natural, organic. People are really warming up. Uh, oak has become very popular again, but with just different finished tones in the oak. Uh, so definitely, just kind of warmer woods, more natural, more organic is really the way the, the market's going. So are you seeing like those cool grays kind of go out and like warmer like paint colors coming in or? Uh, yeah, somewhat. I think the grays are still sticking with the walls more than anything rather than the wood tones more gray in the furniture, but definitely more jewel tones and warm tones in accessories and um, just overall decor and art and whatnot. And those pops of colors, I think people want more warmth in their life again. Okay, so let's flip it to um, what are you seeing in trends that you are not a fan of? What are the trends that you hate to see when you walk into a house? Um, honestly, over the years, uh, over the last couple years, everybody was white, gray, white, gray. And I think maybe the pandemic was part of the problem that everybody needed to feel good again and feel cozy in their homes. So um, that, I'm really glad it's leaving or somewhat leaving. Um, again, it's still kind of around, but um, I'm a fan of a little bit more like timeless, more classic. Uh, so I tend to gravitate towards more something that's going to stand the test of time and a little less of those specific trends that are just seem very um, minimal, you know, as far as time frame that they're gonna last. Um, I know for me, I hate to go into a house that's super trendy. I mean, no offense to you that love Joanna Gaines. Um, I love her too, but I love it when they like kind of scatter it in a little bit, um, but when it's so specific, I agree with you. I think it's going to be something that kind of comes and goes and then we're tired of it in a couple of years. Absolutely, I would agree. I think, um, those specific styles just date themselves too much. And I think uh, the mixture of style, a little bit of traditional, a little bit of modern is really the way to go. Yeah, awesome. Well, thank you so much for talking with me today. Absolutely.